Hello adventurers, my name is Siam Metsu, and with Thanksgiving just around the corner, the Black Desert team and I wanted to express our gratitude to our lovely adventurers by cooking you all an amazing surprise. So let's go ahead and say hello to our wonderful chefs who've joined us here today. All right, so we have our wonderful chefs joined with us here today. Why don't you all introduce yourselves? Hello, my name is Chef Maslam, the infamous orchard owner. Uh, I've been cooking for several years now, since I was a kid. Mostly Southern cuisine, a little Asian cuisine, definitely some Mexican food. So I'm excited to share with you guys what I know. Greetings, guys. I am GM Ash, you already know me. Came from my dark forest today to cook you guys some nice food. I'm pretty good at cooking some Indian food and also French cuisine and pretty good at baking myself. So looking forward to showing you my skills. Hello everyone, I am C.A. Makash. Um, I don't know much about cooking, but I'll be trying my best. Um, you know, fake it till you make it, so... <laughs> Let's cook! With Thanksgiving just around the corner, we wanted to prepare a very special meal that you all might be familiar with. It's our own spin, or our own take, on the Valencia meal. So, let's get cooking! Greetings, adventurers! I'm here today to make the Valencia meal. This time, just two pots of it. I'm making a test sandwich and a fig pie. As you can see here, it's not figs, it's apples. I'm not a fan of fig, so I'm making apple pie instead. We have four apples here that are green and four that are red. We have some eggs, some flour, some cheese, some butter. And for our test sandwich here, we have our Parmesan bread, some cheese, pepper jack, some pulled turkey. And we have also our slices here for the entire sandwich. Hello, adventurers. I'll be making the other two parts of the Valencia meal. Here we have some dates for our date palm wine. We have some ground beef for our King of Jungle Hamburg. Not a big fan of lion meat. I don't know about you. But we also have a crowd favorite here, grilled bird meat for your workers to make sure they have all the salmon that they need. Hi, everyone. I am Sia Makash. I will be making couscous today. Um, couscous is part of the Valencia meal. I've never made a couscous salad before. I've never made a salad before. <laughs> so, um, this will be fun. <laughs> and also, I'll be making the kimchi stew, which was released with the Land of the Morning Light update. We got kimchi right over here, obviously. And also a canned tuna, um, because you need some sort of protein in there. And this is my secret ingredient, don't tell anybody. Um, you didn't hear it from me. <laughs> so, this is what I'll be making. Um, it won't be fancy, but it will be edible. So let's get cooking. So Ash, could you go ahead and explain your cutting technique here? So I'm cutting, yeah, I'm going like this to keep myself from cutting myself. And then just go like that, pretty much. Oh, such clean technique. No. <laughs> the most proficient cutting technique oh, amongst warrior, the so. BDO classes. Warrior has a sword. Yes. DK has a Vediant, which could slice up multiple. Well, okay, I would say probably a classic like Tamer as like short sword, or maybe Shy since it's like it starts off with like higher proficiency in life skills, like cooking anyway. So maybe just by default, Shy would have like the best cooking technique. Shy does not get default cooking buff. Doesn't she get like default everything? No, yeah, it's just gathering and alchemy. Cut that out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Cut that out. I think CF it would be tamer. Etsu, not understanding the See Betsu, not know. a shy boy. You didn't know either. I did know. <laughs> what is couscous? What is couscous? I'm asking you, what is it? I'm a man with questions, not answers. So what are we cooking up over here? Uh, what I'm doing right now is seasoning up our meat. I added a bit of an egg and we'll add a little breadcrumb as a binder so that way we get a nice solid patty. Ooh. Now in front of me, I also have the grilled bird, sort of soaking in some seasonings, getting ready to go. What kind of seasoning did we use today? Uh, we have some salt, pepper, garlic, powder, onion powder, paprika. Okay. You know, very BDO seasonings <laughs> yeah. that you one can find in the game. Definitely, definitely. Mm -hmm. 
Prakash, what's up? What are you waiting on right now? I am waiting for the day to be over. <laughs> uh, jokes aside, I'm waiting for the kimchi stew to stew. Explain your method with your kimchi stew. Yeah. My method is to look like you know what you're doing. Am I? <laughs> is it working? Is it? It's. It's not working. Cut that out. Cut that out. So good, man. Oh, oh, he's gonna taste it. That's it. It's edible. Just like how my mom used to make them. How'd your mom used to make it? Not like that. <laughs> cut that out. Cut that out. Cut that out. Wow, well, it looks like we have so much delicious food prepped for us here today. Let's go ahead and ask our chefs what they've made for us. So right here we have our date palm wine. We have some dates, strawberries, blackberries, blueberries, and a little lemon. Here we have our take on our King of Jungle Hamburg. We have a nice seasoned beef patty with rice, a little curry sauce, and a nice egg. And finally, we have our good old worker stamina, our grilled bird meat. We actually cooked these in the air fryer, so it took a little bit faster, I would say, the equivalent of like Guru 50 cooking. So very speedy, very quick. Greetings, adventurers. Ian Mash again. I made the tough sandwich and the Fig pie, but just kidding, apple pie instead. I'm not really a fan of figs, so I'm gonna move with that. Um, test sandwich is usually made with some scorpion meat, but it's Thanksgiving holiday, so of course it's made with turkey meat now instead. I have some sauce here, the red or orange kind of flavor, or hue is more of a spicy term. The white one's more of a Mediterranean flavor, so it's a bit of a salty, garlicky taste to it. And we have my apple pie. All right, here's my kimchi stew. Smells okay. Never, I haven't tasted it yet, but I'm sure it's gonna be all right. This is the couscous. I made it into a salad. Um, and for garnish, I put the green parts of the green onion on top. Um, that's a tip for those who don't know how to cook. You just put it at the end and it makes it look like you know what you're doing. Well, that concludes our lovely process creating this Valencia meal, everyone, with the grilled bird meat and the kimchi stew. Now, there will be a limited time coupon code available for everyone, so make sure you go ahead and redeem that. And again, adventurers, happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving.